Game begin. Well, hello, gentle folk. Uh, we're going to be reviewing this BFT 47 for the AR15.com YouTube channel. Um, this is going to be my first magazine through it, at least here. I think I shot it at like uh, BDU or Iraq Veteran or something like that, but this will be the first magazine I got through this. This is going to be a mixed magazine with a whole bunch of different types of ammo in there. We'll see how it does. Um, purpose of this video is of course, to get some B-roll. And um, we're gonna treat this kind of like some of those gun boxings that I've done for the optics and whatnot. So you guys can tell me the sort of stuff that I want to cover in this. The whole point behind this BFT-47, if, um, if I can just go ahead and say the quiet part out loud, is the community has been critical of Century Arms products. Um, particular AKs and they've said a lot of stuff about what they would rather and what they'd like to see and all that and over the years the internet has had all this stuff that they told Sentry that they wanted to do and best I can tell um, not that they told me this but uh, as far as I can tell this seems to be an attempt from Sentry to address every one of the points that the internet has been making at least within reason so it has the the bulged front trunnion it has the little ledge for the selector switch with the cutout for the bolt catch and the cleaning rod and really pretty furniture. Um, over, So I'm gonna shoot a bunch and um, obviously we get some uh, go no go gauges to measure head space. Um, and I wanna hear from you guys what other stuff you want to see me do to this rifle to uh, assess whether or not Sentry is meeting the demands of the market, so to speak. So, I don't know, I guess uh, without further ado, let's uh, make some pews. No, nope, I broke my target. <laughs> <laughs> well, I haven't shot, I haven't shot for groups yet, but point of impact seems to be pretty close. Knocking those rocks around real good. Well, so far so good. As always, it's kind of a shame to shoot anything without a can on it. So I think I'm gonna just go ahead and attach this can here. Make for make shooting a little bit more pleasurable. And uh, we'll get on with the rest of it. Ooh, it, there we go. I suck at AK mags. Still smoking pretty good. Oozing a little bit of that 
machine oil out of there. That part's hot. The black parts get hot. It's uh, smoking. Got it good and hot. Get some of that, some of that lube, some of that finish cooked off of there. So far, so good. I'm gonna put a whole bunch of rounds through this. You guys tell me what you want to see in the review, and uh, stay tuned to the AR15.com YouTube channel and. I'll give you my opinions and thoughts and what furs when I'm done putting my fingers all over it. I love you.